We can use Jupyter chart to show stock data. To do so, we import Yahoo Finance and Jupyter charts from lightweight charts. Next, we get the historical data of Tesla from Yahoo Finance. In the return data, the date is used as the index, but we need it as an individual column, and the column name should be in lowercase. So we reset the index and adjust the columns. Now the columns are in lowercase, date is as an individual column, and the new index is created. Finally, we use Jupyter chart to show the historical data in a professional candlestick chart and set the symbol as watermark. So with a few lines of Python code, we get a good looking chart. You can move around and change the width to fit more data on the screen.